Hi Taurus, it's Elle here to do a quick reading for you. It's going to be titled, What Your Person, or whomever you're coming to the reading for, what they want to say to you. All right, so let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Taurus with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so let's see. What does your person want to say to you? Travel. So they would travel to you. You get around. You don't settle down. There's no commitment. What does your person want to say to you? Yeah, you may be kind of blonde here or naive or just unlearned, unknowing, long distance. Maybe this person is at a long distance or they feel like you feel like you. Your person wants to tell you that they think you think they're stupid. OK, um, they want to surprise you also pop up, show up, unannounced, um, a surprise, least expected. What's your per they feel like you're their true love. Okay. This, this is reading like stalker or somebody who just don't get the message that maybe it's over or it's done. Yeah. They have a lot of passion for you or they want to have sex with you, spiritual growth. So they feel like they can grow with you spiritually. They also could feel like this is a karmic relationship. This is what your person wants to tell you um, that you need to grow up spiritually or you need to have some spiritual growth. You need to stop using your sex or sex appeal to get what you want or to you have sex too fast this is what your person wants to tell you what your person wants to you need to work on yourself or this relationship was a lot of work this is what they want to say not what i want to say all right um maybe the work that you do it doesn't offer for growth spiritual growth i don't know if you do exotic dancing if you do something i don't know this is what your person is saying they are saying you have a family you need to be thinking about family matters um you need to stay at home um, you need to be thinking about family. Family matters. This is what your person is telling you. You need to stay home sometime. You don't need to always be out. Um, maybe in bars, nightclubs. Let's see. What does your person want to tell you? They feel like you're a twin flame. Okay. There's a lot of resonance between two. You, you resonate with one another. Okay. They want to tell you that um, maybe they have found a new lease, new love in their life. Maybe even a new person or just a new lease on life. Or maybe they look at the relationship differently oh young female so maybe they um want to tell you that maybe they have somebody different they have somebody new they're not concerned about the relationship anymore um maybe that they've moved on um uh, what let me see what else your person wants to tell you um freedom yeah um so this carefree connection brought about fun times and that's all the connection is this is what your person wants to tell you somebody here wants to tell you that maybe you are a fun girl they travel to you to see you to have fun with you um and that is it they have a family and they're trying to work on their family and they're putting this relationship behind it was fun times it was free fun having a good time with you but now it is over once yeah somebody's got a new lease or a, a new outlook on life here um they do feel like you're a twin flame they feel like there's a real connection there but at the same time, they feel like you're more so into yourself, fashion, beauty. Um, you're too unlearned. Maybe you don't have wisdom with you just yet. This is what your person wants to tell you. Um, you're out too much. They want to tell you that they can't be out as much. They have a family or that you have a family. Maybe you need to put more time or energy into your family. That the connection was just passionate. Okay. So let's see what else they want to tell you. What else does this person want to tell Taurus? Well, they, I don't know if they want to talk anymore. Yeah, the hermit card. Like, they, some, they're they done. They're ghosting this. And it's, you know, the hand of destiny, the hand of the universe stepping in here. Um, Wheel of Fortune. They've changed their mind about this, about this connection. They thought it was okay, but now they're, they're figuring that it's not. They, they thought it was okay to have a third party, to have more than enough. But now they figured, no, I don't need that. Yeah, they listen to their intuition. They don't want to have you as a secret woman or the secret man anymore. Okay. Let's say a reshuffle, please. All right. So let's see. Um, this person knows that a decision has to be made and they made one. And it's, it might just be that they're leaving this behind. Um, yeah. They, they're worried about the long term. They're trying to be rational. They could be a husband um, or a boyfriend or whatever. And they're more concerned about who or what they have obligation to. 
Yeah, they're concerned about closing this cycle out, maturity, and keeping this hidden. Okay, keeping this in the dark and putting a pause, a halt on this relationship, on this secret relationship. Wow, I can't make it up. So fun times here and now. This is the Knight of Wands. This is how they look at the relationship as, you know, it was, you know, freedom. It was fun times. This is what I have for you. If it resonates, let me know how it resonates for you down in the comment section. It could be uh, vice versa. This is what you could be telling somebody. Let me know how it resonates for you. Is this vice versa? Is this for you? Did somebody ghost you? Did somebody change their mind about some, you know, fun, carefree connection? Or did you change your mind? Um, get your own personal reading uh, at the website level. Uh, readings are 40% off. Use code 40 off at the web at checkout. And uh, catch me live every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday night, 9.30 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can ask a question or two right now by texting your question to the number below. Uh, thank you. Many blessings to you. Take care.